So you've just seen me throw together an incredible groove using two drum modules and a slice module. Now what I want to do is introduce you to the stretch module. And for that, I'm going to take this vocal file right here in the edit window. Let's take a listen. The Sabbath show hangs. I'm going to drag it in. To their main. Make it a stretch I module. I want to you, you'll be changing all your Let place. me stop Pro Tools and press play on the sequencer. The Sabbath show hangs. Now I want to hear it in context, so let's hit play on the axiom, get everything going. I'll begin by selecting the phrase synthesizer and I'll change the mode to vocoder and bring down the format and bring up the pitch. Nice. So up to the effects, I'm going to add the beat cutter effect and then just use the mouse. So I'm going to come down and bring up the reorder parameter, maybe the gate and the gate time. Add some delay with effects too. And of course, we can keep going with this without stopping, all on the fly and all without breaking our creative flow. Nice. Let's do it again with a different vocal phrase, drag it in, make it a stretch module. Again, we'll add the beat cutter. Now you can imagine just how long it would take you to do this kind of stutter, scratching, freezing with anything other than transfuser. But of course, I'm only scratching the surface of what transfuser is truly, truly capable of. Once you dig into it, you're gonna be absolutely floored. Let's add a bass line and maybe a synth and really get this thing hopping. So I'm gonna go back over to the audio tab of the browser and I'm just searching the factory content. I'm looking for a bass line here and the folder that I'm browsing is full of bass loop rec files, all at different tempos. Yet with browser sync turned on, I can simply audition these in perfect sync with Pro Tools. I'm gonna come up, hit play, and let's look for a synthesizer. Maybe something that my friend Tim would love. How about this, Tim? And hit play. I come off. I get down and give it, give it, give it, give it. <laughs> Just amazing. Now, out of all of the tracks that we've got going in this transfuser document, only one of them is in latch mode, and that's why we still hear it when the pattern note is not held down. And this alone is remix heaven. Check it out. If I go over to the insert section, just here, we've got four effects inserts. I've got beat cutter on number one. So with my left hand on the pattern key, my right hand on the mouse, I can do this kind of stuff. And of course, I can do all of this on the Axiom keyboard because every parameter in Transfuser is completely assignable to anything on your controller. Absolutely incredible. You know, I cannot keep my hands off this amazing plugin. You are absolutely gonna love it. So you've seen the drum module, you've seen the slice module, you've seen the stretch module, and you've also seen some of the incredible effects like Beat Cutter and the Kill EQ. Now in the next video, we'll take a break from making music and take a look at Transfuser's incredible UI, in particular, the master section. So be sure to join me.